So guys, when I did um, have my braces in, one thing I did say is like, oh, I don't smile a lot, but now that I've got braces, once I get them out, I have to smile more often. So I do try. Hi everybody, assalamu alaikum, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me again today. In this video I'm just going to be talking about how to take care of your teeth, specifically after having braces, so let's do this. So guys, firstly I just want to say well done on keeping your braces in till the end of the treatment. I know it's not easy, the duration does vary depending on like your teeth and what they need but all in all it's not easy at all and you did it so well done you should be proud of yourself for that okay so i do have three quick tips on how to take care of your teeth after braces the first one should be the most important one it's retainers you literally have to keep them in because they do prevent your teeth from shifting back because they do say like i guess your jaw has like memory so your teeth could sort of shift back and then all the hard work with the braces and everything to do with braces will be for nothing. So you have to keep in your retainers. And with that said, you have to be honest with the retainers. You can sort of manage. So there are three types of retainers. There is the permanent one. So you sort of have it in your, like at the back of your teeth, the back row permanently so you don't have to worry about them they're just in there and then this the other two are both temporary there's a clear plastic one that you just have like pop in and then we do have the holy retainer which is sort of like a wire and then a plastic bit that does go onto your like palette like at the top so they all have different disadvantages and advantages and i do encourage you to look them up to see what sort of fits you and your personality and just what you can manage to maintain so in my case I did have um, a permanent retainer put at the bottom row and then at the top I was given the holy retainer and I just couldn't manage it so I did go back to the dentist and I got a permanent one put at the top and it's it's much easier for me I prefer this I do have the other retainer with me but this is perfect for me so yeah, you have to be honest with what you can manage. Let's move on to number two, which is brushing your teeth. You should literally brush um, twice a day. And with that in mind, you could have, this is just what I do. You could have two different types of toothpaste for like the day and the night. And you should make sure you change your toothbrush every three to four months. I do have um, a different toothbrush for the morning and night, but that's just what I do. And you should also consider your, like your teeth, your mouth, in general and what it needs so if your teeth are sensitive you should get something like sensodyne which is what I use as well actually I do have three different types of toothpaste but it's all right the more the merrier but you should always use like a pea size amount okay you don't have to fill the toothbrush with a lot of toothpaste it's not necessary yeah so um, sensitive teeth if you're taking a lot of caffeine and like smoking stuff like that you should consider that and you could always have a mouthwash to sort of supplement but brushing is really important and the toothbrush i have does have like um ridges at the back on the other side so that's you that's for like scraping your tongue like cleaning your tongue so you could brush your tongue lightly not like brushing really hard and then use the other side to sort of scrape it to get any dirt and everything or you could get an actual tongue cleaner but when thinking of your teeth and yes we do want to keep our teeth like in the best condition you should think of your tongue as well and and your mouth in general sort of so the third point is using dental floss picks and i think that's mostly if you have a permanent retainer it's really helpful to try and like get in there because you do have the wire at the back so you're not going to easily floss like this but i still do try and a tip that I sort of would recommend is putting some toothpaste on the floss pick, like on both sides. It does have, you know, the floss and then it has a plastic prickly end. So you could do that and then just try to get in between your retainer, like as best as possible. I do um, use the floss as well and try to get in there as far up as I can. And yeah, 
just try to keep it all clean because with a permanent retainer like a downside is you can't take it out and properly floss and all that so you do have to consider all these things when getting a retainer yeah guys so those are all my three quick tips on taking care of your teeth after having braces and just in general and i do have one bonus tip which is to visit the dentist like every six months or more often depending on like your teeth and your situation just make sure to get it checked out and that's about it guys i am sure there could be a thousand other things to um, consider on how to take care of our teeth but at least we could have these few things like these three quick tips at the front of our mind every single day twice a day because we have to brush at least twice a day yeah guys so thank you so much for watching be sure to like this video subscribe down to my channel and hit the notification bell to get notified each and every time i upload you could leave a comment down below or a quick tip for anyone else watching this video to just read through the comments and take it into consideration so we can all you know take care of our teeth and be happy about it so yeah guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video love BB Permanent permanent We have a bonus tip which is to visit it in the back which is for like cleaning your tongue